okay people we are back and we have the new track rod arm i think that's what it's called i think that's what it's called so yeah so today i will be figuring out how to get down to here i'll have to go underneath the vehicle i think let's try and get under the vehicle shall we and um get this done so um yeah let's give it a go <laughs> I should be able to get my hand in here, <coughs> to here. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, here we go. Here they are. Got it out. Here's a new one. That's out. Hopefully they're the same size. Hey, look. Oh, when I tried it on for size a minute ago. Oh, sweet. Yeah, they're pretty much bang on the same size. So, let's um, get the new one. That's what I took it out of. You can't even see. It's so hard to see this little um thing here. I can't even show you. It's impossible to show you. Let me just right, let me just get this one on and then we can get on with lowering the car and putting the suspension on, can't we? Okay, peeps, here we go. The last corner is going on. So how am I gonna do this? I can't remember how I did the other side now. Um, right, let's get you up and out of the way a minute. Just there. I know there's gonna be a problem like that. Let's just put you over there a minute. Right. There, what I did last time was I put it up the top and put the screw on up there, so I'll do that first. There we go. Right, let's just um, get up there. You go. Get up in the hole. There we go. is down on all fours time to take it out into the light and see how it looks ah oh, damn okay give me a sec i'm gonna put the steering wheel back on then i'm gonna drive it back out into the light to see how it looks <laughs> okay peeps here it is i've got it out of the workshop down the big hill um it's looking all right you know when i sit in it i need to roll the arches bad because when i sit in it they rub on the arches but um here we go um i'll take explain to you why i've got the bonnet open in a second It's not sitting as low as I thought it was going to, if I'm honest, but hopefully it will settle a bit. I can adjust the rears. So there we have it. But now we have another problem, um, which I wasn't expecting. Every time I sort this car out, something else goes on it, which is starting to really piss me off, if I'm honest. I've just got it out of my workshop, which is up there, down this big swoopy hill. Do you can see how steep that is? Um, I was just messing around with the carburetor trying to get it to work and for some reason you know I was starting it up checking it out and now whenever I turn the key 
This happens. Oh. oh. Battery's completely dead. <laughs> so I can't get it back into the workshop because <laughs> the battery's dead. So, um, yeah. I need to go charge his battery and push, just push the car back. So bear with me. You don't think that after all that I'm not going to leave you with some decent lowered shots of the vehicle, do you? It's montage time. Right, that's enough of that. I'm currently stuck here until um, the battery charges. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I'm gonna call it today on that one. Um, you don't really wanna see me playing with the carb once I've got the battery charged up and stuff. To be fair, I'll probably do that tomorrow now because it'll probably be dark by the time it's charged. So yeah, um, that is the vehicle lowered. It's not as low as, what's, I say it's not as low as I thought it was gonna be. I think it is as low as I thought it was gonna be now. When I get in it, the back wheels rub so the next video will be me um rolling the arches i think but not, i don't use an arch roller i use a hammer and a bit of wood so uh, old school baby <laughs> so yeah that's today's video done that's a wrap don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more videos um yeah so i'll see you in the next one which should hopefully be either me rolling the arches tomorrow or uh doing the speedo cable when it arrives <laughs>